tell what time of the day it is. Yeah. Because, like, we're both yawning. We can barely start the video. I just had a good yawn. <laughs> so did I. Uh, hi. Welcome to Midweek Update with Pastor Brian and Donna Lynn. And, uh, yeah, we kind of need that afternoon cup of coffee or something. Actually, that's a great idea. Oh. <laughs> I think I might have to do that when uh, I'm done. Yeah, just don't. I don't know. I'm not even sure what time it is anymore. Just don't spill the coffee on your foot. <laughs> Okay. Um, would you like to tell us the story, Brian? <laughs> I was getting coffee the other morning. Monday. And <laughs> you see, I don't. I and don't. I hear I don't from the like other room. That, <laughs> I burnt my foot. Right. So I don't like burning my my tongue on super hot coffee. <laughs> so I was gonna try to get an ice cube to put in my coffee and and I'm holding coffee in my left hand and I'm trying to get the ice cube with my right hand and then I dropped the ice cube and jiggled the coffee <laughs> spilled piping hot coffee on my left foot and I burned my foot and <laughs> which my kind and caring wife <laughs> It's in tears laughing. It's in tears laughing because we had just watched the episode of The Office where Michael burned his foot. And so, yeah, it was hysterical to my wife. Still is. <laughs> How's your foot today? <laughs> it's feeling better. Thank you for asking. And, and your care and concern is... Touching is bringing healing to my foot. <laughs> oh, my stomach hurts so bad. <laughs> oh, okay, that was good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so this sorry, is, you This is what I live with, people. <sighs> oh, hi. <laughs> so anyway, welcome to Midweek Update. That's, you know... Uh, yes, the good news is today Sweet Home got out of level one, so we are in, no, we have no evacuation levels, Orders. even though level one didn't really mean evacuate. It says level one evacuation, but it's more like you're on the list. Uh, so we're out of that. It's good stuff. We're moving in the right direction. And so, uh, you know, this everything keeps changing on us, so... Yeah, for last Sunday, there was no way we were going to do outside church uh, in, in, like, air that's trying to kill you. <laughs> and so we just did the inside service. And mm -hmm. I, I hate to just keep changing things on you. Uh, so we're, we're going to just stick with one service at 10:30 mm -hmm. on Sundays we can have a but you know they they change the numbers on how many people we can have in church we're fine to have church at 10:30 mm -hmm. and uh, I rearranged all the chairs on Monday and you're supposed to say yeah it looks good yeah <laughs> it looks amazing okay Is that well good? it looks good okay. yeah it does like so now there's no more rows reserved yeah. There's more space. Now you've got them. you got spacing in between the rows, mm -hmm. and so now these are luxury aisles, so you don't have to like step over people. <laughs> Lots of leg. Room. Lots of leg room. Lots of yes, leg room. Yes. So and and we just set up all over the place, clear back into the fellowship mm -hmm. halls. So <sighs> yes, even though we had fires, we still have coronavirus. So mm -hmm. we're trying to social distance and all of this wonderful. stuff stuff in this world yay well you know and i'm actually it's it's really nice that we have chairs where we have the You're flexibility right. to move things around a little bit yep yeah. you know janice was here uh yesterday and she looked at it and she said oh good and she said this is what i was thinking when when i suggested we go to chairs uh is we can kind of rearrange at times like this so Anyway, we're going to stick with 1030 service. It'll be fine. It'll be great. Uh, and maybe, maybe next week we'll be able to get away 
for our little vacation for a few days. I did check with my right? work situation and, and, and I can sneak away. Okay, good. So that's good. good. So maybe next week we're finally going <laughs> to. I don't know. We'll see Here's what hoping. happens. <laughs> It's 2020. Oh, uh, who knows? <laughs> who knows? We could, I don't know. Uh, and so that's coming up. Uh, let's see. And the ladies Bible study is starting on the, on the 30th, I believe. Whatever um, that Wednesday is. I believe it's the 30th, maybe. Uh, well, today's the 23rd. So then, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, so yeah. <gasps> no, today is not the twenty third. That it's is next not. Wednesday. That's I was working on things for the twenty third, <laughs> but I do know that is a thing. Today's the sixteenth. Oh, <laughs> well, when you work for the newspaper, now you're always working ahead, right? And so yes. my mind is usually a little bit ahead. Don't confuse them. Today's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused already. And oh, uh, coming up, uh, we're gonna do a uh, harvest offering. Oh, I don't remember the date on that, but it's uh, October 6th, maybe, something like that, give or take. Uh, nope, it's something like that, though. Uh, you have it. October 11. It's going to be in there. Oh, Canadian Thanksgiving. Canadian Thanksgiving, yeah. which doesn't mean anything no, to them, but it means it's, it's Columbus Day weekend. <laughs> Uh, but uh, we'll do harvest offering kind of like we've been doing the past several years and we'll divide it up and half of that will go to Shem and then we'll have like uh, uh, a fourth uh, go to the Hope Center and a fourth go to the um, Pregnancy Care Center. So we have a special offering to help out these special uh, uh, ministries in our community. And so that, that's coming up down the road. We'll, we'll have that you know you'll you'll know about this ahead of time and stuff mm -hmm. but oh my goodness yes we're it's it's happening and i you know last sunday it was so smoky our um air quality index number was 501 sunday morning Yikes. and so anything over 300 is hazardous and we had people who had to evacuate and all of that so we just did one service and uh, more people came than I thought. My dad, he said to me, ah, it's about twice as many as I thought would be here. And so, uh, so the, you know, we had a good Sunday and it was good yeah. to be together. Mm -hmm. And so that's, uh, we need each other. Uh, I talked with our evacuated peoples uh, and George and Janie are back home. Uh, the Oh, Don and Glenda Hopkins, they're back home. I called uh, Gail Thomas yesterday, and she had just walked in the door <laughs> going back home. Good timing. She said, yeah, she said, well, you caught me. I just walked in the door. So uh, she's uh, from Gail's place. I guess the fires were six miles away, uh, which is six miles, but that's still... Feels like you can. It's a lot closer than you want it to be. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, oh, praise the Lord, everybody in our church is, is seems to be mm -hmm. doing okay. We keep praying for all of this uh, mess, and it's 2020. We're wondering what's going to happen next. Uh, but uh, we are grateful that we have uh, each other. Mm -hmm. uh, we're grateful that God is with us no matter what the circumstance. And. Um, we turn to him all the time oh my word i don't know uh yeah how do you how do you get through this without the lord oh yeah uh let's see is there anything else we need to cover i don't know i don't know okay <clears throat> life is just moving along oh it is it is <laughs> it's it's still slightly smoky here in the church not as bad as it was but um Oh, we're... I was undecided. I'm like, is my glasses dirty or is it smoky in the church? Well, <laughs> both. I, uh, uh, yeah. Oh, it's not as smoky as I thought it was. <laughs> Maybe that's the truth. Oh, dear. Uh, ah. Lord, we thank you that you watch over us. Lord, we thank you for our church here in Sweet Home. Lord, thank you for just such wonderful people. Help us to love one another and help us to show your love to a world that desperately needs you. People are 
searching for you. They're searching for all kinds of answers and, and trying all kinds of strange things. But Lord, all of our needs can be found in you. And Lord, help us to turn to you. Help us to direct people toward you. Uh, give us the privilege of introducing people to Jesus Christ. Lord, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hey, Lord bless you. Have a wonderful rest of the week. See you Sunday. Yeah, I'll be here. <laughs>